Well, five terms in office over 15 years are about to come to an end for Dunedin City Councillor Sid Brown, the Chairman of the Finance and Strategy Committee and former Deputy Mayor, joins us tonight to look back on his career. Good evening, Councillor Brown. Good evening. Well, congratulations on your decision. Firstly, I guess, what, what was the decision What made you choose this, this option to, to not stand again? Oh, I think 15 years of community service. Um, I think I've done my bit for the community. Uh, I've enjoyed it, but uh, there's a time to move on, and for me, I think this is the time. Looking back on those on those 15 years, you, you would have seen a, um, a lot of change. What what's what would be the most satisfying thing for, for, for you over that time? I, I think, from my point of view, it's uh, it's always about serving your community and make sure that Dunedin's a great place to live, work, and play. And um, I think coming through some tough economic times and uh, that we've always managed to get through without too much pain in Dunedin and uh, that is because we've provided that opportunity for businesses to be successful and the community has grown and uh, you look at Dunedin City now, there's not an amenity here that you won't find anywhere else, so, so we're well served. Uh, when you look back on your time, is there anything that you, you may have done differently, any decisions you would have changed? No, not really. Um, to me, integrity plays an important part when you're serving your community. Um, you've got to place that high on the list. And um, for the community to understand, to be successful in a council, democracy is all about numbers, and um, you've really got to gain the respect and the credibility of your uh, fellow councillors to, to um, be successful because you need seven other people to agree with you. So um, I think showing respects to your colleagues and... Uh, making sure that you've got your community at heart. Well, you supported the stadium, um, Councillor. What are your thoughts now on how the, the facility has developed uh, over, over time? Um, I think the stadium's something that's going to gain momentum. Um, when you look at it now, we've probably got the only covered stadium that's likely to be in New Zealand. So we've now got a, an icon, which is going to be an attraction for the future. Um, I think it's going to sit within the university and the city's economic development strategy coming forward and it's going to play a major part now in uh, serving the whole of New Zealand. The, the changing face of our, of our city council, how, how do you view it now, uh, looking ahead in, in, the, in the short term, I guess? Um, I think from, from the perspective, we've now got a very focused, and we always have had, a very focused uh, a lot of staff in the in the city, and I've had the pleasure of working along some very talented people. Um, they choose the city council as their career path, and uh, I think we have to be thankful that we've got such high calibre people working for us in the city. It's very easy to criticise the city and say the city does this or the city does that, but I mean it's um, administering a very wide area from. I think we've got the largest man mass area of, of land in New Zealand in, within the Dunedin City's boundaries, so um, they serve the city well. What does the, the future hold for, for Sid Brown now? Oh, more time with the family, um, probably more time to, uh, to my business commitments and, and hopefully some leisure time. All right, congratulations on the decision once again. Thanks for your time this evening. A pleasure.